Welcome to this Sage Business Vision 2011 new feature overview. In this overview we will discuss the new Record of Employment electronic file feature. We will begin by opening Sage Business Vision 2011. Sage Business Vision 2011 has been enhanced to include the ability to not only print a Record of Employment but to file it electronically with Service Canada. To show this feature, first we must terminate an employee in Sage Business Vision Payroll. To terminate an employee, first we select Edit, Payroll, Details. This opens up the Employee Details dialog box. We'll look up all of our employees and find the employee that we want to terminate. That's Jennifer Jason. Now that we have her record open, we need to change her status to Terminated. Next, we need to go into the Details tab and enter the date that she was terminated on. We're going to terminate her as of July 26, 2011. We now save her record and close the dialog box. Now that we have terminated an employee, we must print their Record of Employment for Service Canada. The ability to print a Record of Employment has been removed from the Earnings Summary dialog box in Sage Business Vision and now has its own dedicated utility. To open this utility, first select Edit, Payroll, Record of Employment. The first thing Sage Business Vision wants to do is populate the list of terminated employees on the Record of Employment dialog box. To do this, we're going to do this by date. We terminated Jennifer Jason as of July 26, 2011. We have now defined a start and end date for terminated employees as 7-26-2011. We're going to also provide some information specific to the Record of Employment form that we need to file. That includes the name of the contact person at your company who's filling out the form. As well as the contact person's phone number. as well as how we want to file our Record of Employment. We can do so via the web, which means Sage Business Vision will generate an XML file for the Record of Employment, or we can still print it if we wish to on the actual form. In this particular demonstration, we're going to generate the XML file that we need to file it via ROE Web on the Service Canada website. Now that I've defined the criteria for the list of employees for whom I wish to issue an ROE, I can click OK to pull that list up on my Record of Employment dialog box. Because I listed a start and end date of 7-26-2011, only Jennifer Jason shows up on this list. Now I must define some specific information as to why Jennifer Jason was terminated. To do that, first I mark the checkbox next to Jennifer's name to indicate that I want to generate an ROE for her. Next I click the Modify button at the top of the dialog box. This will pull open a dialog box that allows me to fill in specific information for the Record of Employment. The first thing I need to do is list the reason for her, being, for her leaving the company. I'm going to list that she left due to a shortage of work. Next, I need to make sure that I put down the insurables on line 15A for the total number of hours that are insurable in this period. Now that I've done that, I've put in the required information, I can click Save to save this record of employment. Finally, I must create the XML file that I need to upload my record of employment to Service Canada. To do that, I simply go and click the Up Export to Web button at the top of the Record of Employment dialog box. Sage Business Vision will ask me where I wish to create the XML file. I'm going to choose to create it right on my Windows desktop. Now that I have this location selected, I simply need to click Save. Sage Business Vision will inform me that the file has been created successfully, but that I need to upload this to the Service Canada Record of Employment Online tool, known as ROE Web. The address is provided directly on the dialog box. Thank you for attending this Sage Business Vision 2011 new feature overview. If you have more questions about Sage Business Vision, please visit us on the web at www.sagebusinessvision.com. 
If you're interested in upgrading to Sage Business Vision 2011, please contact your Sage Business Vision business partner or call us at Sage at 1-800-945-8007. And as always, we would like to know how we can make Sage Business Vision better meet the needs of your business. If you have new feature ideas, please send us an email at productenhancements.vv at sage.com.